now you're getting to the reimagine, right? To the reimagine then is what is the ecosystem that you're creating so that if I am uh, a Nick Jordan in a community like that, how do I tap into that going on and make sure that I am number one, part of it, and number two, uh, growing as a result of it, you know, taking advantage of it, not in a negative way, but in a positive way, you know? Um, and I think that is where the communities nowadays, so very traditional, uh, you know, ecosystems have been very traditional ecosystems where you, you know, you move in, you move, you, uh, you get to know some people, you might join the Chamber of Commerce, you find a banker, um, you talk to your neighbors of, of, about, you know, what school system your kids could, could go to and you, and you start to engage in that kind of stuff. What, it, it's, it's not an easy path. It, there's no one path, but there's also no, what I refer to as, there's also no journey map. <laughs> what communities need to do, and, and some of the ones I've been working on are, how do we create, how do we reinvent the small business ecosystem that makes it very clear, easy, and supportive and inclusive of the, of the, of the larger uh, community at large? And how do we make that journey easier? Uh, how, do we, how, do we, how do we put up a map um, on a, on a web page that says, Hey, you interested? Welcome. Welcome. You interested in starting a business? You're interested in connecting to a business. Here are the five stops along the way you have got to make. And here are the people that you've got to introduce yourself to. And those people have to be willing to be listed. And those people have to be willing to be part of the connection process. And we have, I have communities that are busy trying to figure that out right now.